seven or what did, what did you? What did you uh, cut, Final Cut four. Oh, okay. Well, it should be the same. The process should still be the okay. same as long as Final Cut four supports um, the what the, the the P two format that they shoot shoot at. So again, the camera has a, has power, USB cable into there. I'm going to plug this into the back okay. of the computer, just wherever you have a USB spot. Got it. Okay. Okay. Now, I'm not sure if this camera actually has any picture on it. Does it have any? It has any. So when you turn it on, it usually defaults to the, the base camera mode. You hit the button, and it goes Which into button? Your, this button right here. So, so yeah, so let me just, I'm going to turn it off. Okay. So right here, power button. Okay. Flip it on. And the screen right here comes uh -huh. on. And it defaults to camera mode. So like, right now the lens cap's on, if I take it off, see? Right. Okay. But to go to VTR mode, that's where you're looking at footage on the camera. One thing you want to check is down here. See this little switch? Hold on. You can see that. Yeah, I got it. There, it's a, it might not be able to see, but basically it says on the bottom it says media, P2 and tape, and you want it to be on P2 if you're using the P2 cards. Okay, got that. Because if it's on tape, that that uses the stuff over here. If you're, okay. if you're using tapes, but if you're using P2, that needs to be over here because when you hit this button right here, I'm gonna hit that. The, the screen switches uh -huh. up here, uh -huh. and you navigate it using um, these things on the top. It's kind of a clunky. Design, but you see right here on the top of the camera. Yeah. This is how you navigate them. All these buttons, so you can. Go so like, it's it's gonna be hard to film this, but yeah, I like it. So if I hit down. Uh -huh. And over on it, like on the screen right here, uh -huh. I'm cycling through media. Okay. Uh huh. Oh, I see. So it's showing each picture. Right? Yeah, like over here, it's just you're, I'm navigating through this. Go ahead. See, I'm just going through it like that. And I'm not sure what this footage is exactly. So it's my I'm, wedding. Okay, so it's it's on. So you, this is stuff you want to done. Okay. All right. So so how do you? So the next thing is like, okay, you have all the media and you want to dump the, these these cards that are in right. here right I now. I want to dump them onto the computer. Right. What you have to do is you have to turn it turn the camera into a thing called uh, USB mode or PC mode. Where's that? And this, this is the this is the trickiest part. Okay. So remember that that button down here that I hit like to go to the VTR mode. If I hit it again. It goes back to camera mode. Right. That's just the way to go back and forth. If I hit it again, it goes back to VTR mode. Okay. Hit it again, it goes back to camera mode. That's just the toggle on and off. But if you want to go to if you want to go to USB mode or PC mode, so have your USB cable plugged in and go to camera mode, and then press and hold this like you're going to go to VTR but hold it, and it takes about three seconds. Great. And usually, so let me try this again. It might you might have to actually be in VTR mode. Okay, so when you're in VTR mode, just press and hold it, and on the screen right here, see? Mm -hmm. Right here, USB device connect. And on the computer right here, yeah. these two things pop up. It says no name, no name. That's the two cards inside of That's your in there. camera. Yes. So it, they're not labeled on, on but this. So like in here is your media. So this is one of the cards, see? And this is the USB, I mean, this is the P2 format. Right. And I'll, I'm going to, this, it's kind of a, tricky way to do this, but like, let me open up the second one. So there's two different, both of these cards have stuff on them, okay? So what I usually do is I, I make a folder, so let's call this, um, it's the um, folder's down here, but I'll call it uh, John, is it? Uh, John Reno. One. Is it, uh, do you use H in your name? Or? Yeah, J O H N. Okay. Reno, and you said what kind of wedding? Uh, um, Robert Miano's wedding, just put Robert's wedding. Robert's uh, wedding, like that. Okay, so that's up here. Open that up. So I'm just trying, this is basic project organization. So in here, and I'm gonna go to this, little, I like to use this little thing. So like we're in the that folder right now, okay? I'm gonna drag this over. I'm just gonna make a folder and call it source footage, like that. Mm -hmm. And then in here, I'm gonna make just, I'm gonna be in very basic card 001. Zero, zero, two. And then car zero zero two, right. right? Exactly. And within this, you want to copy every. You want to copy both of these folders. You want, you want everything. You don't want to copy just this part or this part. The way the P two works is you have to have it all. Okay. I'm dropping that in there right now. And there it goes. See. 
So that's 15 gigabytes of data on that card that I'm dumping right now. Uh, so I'm gonna just let that go for a second. Let me, let's see how much is on this card right here. Okay, there's eight gigabytes, so I'm gonna start dumping this one because I need to show you how to import it still. So right now, all we are doing is we're moving files from one place, from, from, the, from these cards, uh -huh. onto your computer, or onto a computer. Okay. That's all I'm doing. So I'm gonna actually cancel a card, the card one because yeah. that's, that's bigger, because I need to show you how to do the other things first. Okay. Um, so, and I'm just gonna delete this just because we don't need it right now. Because we'll, we'll redump this later, because um, that's the 16 gig card, but right now, so it's roughly if you have USB 2 and you prop your computer likely does, but if not, it, it'll just run slower. But USB 2 on our normal speed computer takes roughly a little less than a minute a gigabyte to copy, just to give you a estimation. Is this making sense? Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I just listen to it and go through it. Slower. Yeah, the hardest. So the hardest, the, the 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 trickiest part is when you when you plug the USB in to the camera and then the computer, turn the camera on. Go to VTR mode, so that's when you hit that button, it goes to the VTR. Originally I said hit it when you're in camera mode, go to VTR mode first and then and then let go and then press and hold it again and it's usually, it only takes about two to three seconds. Seconds. And it should, this screen right here right. does this, USB device connect. Okay. Right here. Uh -huh. And when that happens, it, the, they, it these goes. little drives will come up on the computer and okay. you have a Mac, so it should say, and right now it just says no name, but it should look, look like a little, the icon for like basically what a thumb drive would look like if you're plugging in a thumb drive, but those are your cards inside of the camera. See right now, this one's blinking. That card's copying right now. This is going on. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty simple. It's just that that hold the thing down for two seconds. That's the that's the 